Clinton team is pouncing on these tax revelations. Cecilia Vega on the trail with Clinton from the start. She joins us now. Good morning, Cecilia. George, good morning to you. Clinton has said that she's not going to engage Donald Trump in his personal attacks, but these attacks are more personal than ever. Her opponent is now going after her health and her marriage, and it may be a preview of what's to come in the next debate. Donald Trump's newest attack, a dramatic reenactment of Hillary Clinton's near collapse when she was sick with pneumonia. Here's a woman. She's supposed to fight all of these different things, and she can't make it 15 feet to her car. Give me a break. He's going after her mental health, too. She could be crazy. She could actually be crazy. During a weekend rally in the battleground of Pennsylvania, the blistering assault more personal than ever. Trump going after Clinton's marriage, this time not targeting her husband's infidelities, but rather without proof, hers. I don't even think she's loyal to Bill. You want to know the truth. And really, folks, really, why should she be, right? No comment from Clinton during her Sunday visit to a church in North Carolina. Her campaign calling Trump's latest attacks, quote, particularly unhinged. But could it be a trial run of what's to come during their next debate? The Republican nominee hinting that things could get more personal. The last head-to-head -head now fodder for the opening night of the new season of SNL. He is a bully. Shut up. He started the birther movement. You did. He says climate change is a hoax invented by China. It's pronounced China. He hasn't released his tax returns, which means he's either not that rich, Wrong. not that charitable, Wrong. or he's never paid taxes in his life. Warmer. On her campaign plane, Clinton caught on camera laughing about it with her staff. <laughs> Told about this opening scene. I'm better than ever, let's do this. Clinton saying, oh, that's good. It was pretty good. And this morning, a big endorsement for Hillary Clinton from NBA superstar LeBron James, the Ohio native, writing, we need a president who brings us together and keeps us unified. Clinton campaigns in his hometown of Akron later today. Her team hoping his endorsement, George, in this battleground state pays off big. Yeah, it is a tight state right now. Okay, see you. Thanks very much.